I've been getting a lot of questions on how to make NFTs for free. So this video is going to answer that. Hello and welcome to the channel and let's get started. So OpenSea is the largest platform for NFTs currently and you can create NFTs for free on it by using the Polygon network. So let's create an account on it. So visit OpenSea.io and I hope you already have the MetaMask wallet installed. If not, go to my previous video and watch on how to set up your MetaMask wallet. So if you have your MetaMask set up, you just go to OpenSea.io and click this wallet button to connect your wallet. Select MetaMask. Just approve it. Next and connect. Okay, so your wallet is connected now and your profile is created. So let's check out our profile. Let's go to settings. Okay, and sign. Okay, so our profile is ready. Let's add a username. Okay, so fill in your username, bio, email and you can add the profile image and profile banner also. Add your links here, Twitter, Instagram, a website if you have it and click save. And you'll get an email and you'll need to verify it. So I'll just do that. Okay, so here's the email. Click on verify my email. And you're good to go. Back to OpenSea. So let's go back to our profile okay it's made now and let's create some nfts okay go to create and you can create a new item right here but let's not use it let's go to profile okay let's go to my collections and create a collection Okay, so add your logo, feature image, banner image, add a name, add a custom URL and add a description. Select a category and add these links also. Your site, Discord, Twitter, Instagram, Medium and Telegram. Add everything you want to add. It just makes the profile more valid. So let's add a percentage fee. So you'll see you cannot go i think more than 15 so let's say 25 okay so this value cannot be more than 10 so let's say 5 your payout wallet address okay so here you need to enter your metamask wallet or public address where the payment will go to go to your metamask and click here to copy the address add it and this is the step where we will make a change so on, by default the blockchain is selected as ethereum but ethereum costs gas fees for minting and listing nfts which is a one-time fees by the way but for this video we'll select polygon it's a fast gas free blockchain experience so select polygon and the payment token will already be converted to eth which is wrapped ethereum and you can add another tokens but i'll leave it at that then select your display theme i'll keep it contained let's keep it covered for one is to one ratio and explicit and sensitive content we don't have it if your work contains an sfw material you can turn it on but we don't want to so let's check it and create Okay, so the collection has been created and here you will be presented with your collection. So as of now, there is zero items, zero owners, no floor price and no volume traded. So let's add item to it. 
add your image so add your file add a name add an external link if you have one so if you have a lot of nfts you can create a website where you can display all of them and add some more info about them add your description which collection you want it to go we have only one collection so we'll select sapien thoughts so here you can add properties levels and stats so these all show up as different things the properties show up as rectangles the levels show up as a progress bar the stats show up as numbers so if you have any unlockable content you can turn this on if you want to sell this nft and the user will receive some extra content you can turn it on and add the content here like it can be a key a code or link to a file which will only get unlocked when the buyer buys it let's turn it off we don't have explicit content and the number of copies that can be minted the supply is the number of copies that can be minted so let's say let's just add 10 here but you should keep it to one because that's the whole purpose of nfts if you see that unique items have a maximum supply of one meaning only one copy can be ever minted that is a non-fungible token so non-fungible means only one copy so for the video i'll keep it to 10 only but go with one if you have some unique items or you can do whatever you like so let's hit create Okay, so the NFT is created. It's created. It's not yet ready for sale. So we need to sell it also. So you can still edit it. Here you can see. Let's just edit the description. okay we have edited the content the description we don't want to change anything else let's submit changes and success okay so now we will see this freeze metadata option is available it wasn't available before we had made our nft so what this does is once you freeze the metadata you cannot edit it anymore so when you have checked all the files all the things so you can just freeze metadata and click freeze. See it cannot be edited nor removed. All of my content is exactly how, how it's intended to be presented. If you press confirm here it will be locked and it cannot be changed after that. So let's click confirm okay so it's complete let's close it and submit changes okay so this shows cannot be changed because it's frozen already let's go back to our collection and let's let's actually list it for sale so to list it you need to click the sell button so click on sell and list the item for sale choose the quantity you want you have 10 available and choose the quantity you want to sell let's add the amount so do check what amount you want to keep for it because like just go to OpenSea and search for 
the polygon chains and see what are the nfts selling for you can see 0 0.0004 0 0.0035 0 0.01 but if you are just new keep the price reasonable here's the duration how long do you want to make it listing available so let's just keep it six months you can reserve it for a specific buyer so if you turn this on and you put a specific metamask address here only that person can buy it so let's just turn it off and there are fees associated with it but you don't have to pay the fees listing is free once sold the following fees will be deducted from the listing so when you have decided on everything let's complete listing okay so you need to unlock the wrapped teeth currency because you'll be getting paid in wrapped teeth which is eth on polygon so click on unlock and here it is wrapped ether so click sign successful sign message click sign and sign okay so you have listed your nft now you can use this share buttons and or copy the link to share your nft on your socials so when you do make a sale on the polygon network you will get wrapped ethereum so it will be visible in your metamask but you won't see it here you have to actually import the tokens so go to import tokens and add wet h and you'll see wrapped ethereum so click on that and click on next import tokens and you'll see wrapped ethereum also so when you go back to your wallet you'll see eth and you'll see weth so when you make a sale you'll pay it you will be paid in weth so that was it for the video this is how you can create nfts for free on OpenSea. thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one And this is where the main stuff comes in. And this is the main change. And leave any comments in the description.